<laughs> I don't know why I was saying on Chocolate for so long, but greetings entities and guardians. My name is Hyperhind, and welcome to the new update. Chocolate, uh, what was, I was, what was I gonna say Chocolate Cookie? No, Chocolate, Chocolate Bonbon? No, Chocolate Bonbon Cookie has finally been released, and in this episode, we're obviously going to get Chocolate Bonbon in the Plumbing Gotcha, and, uh, we're just gonna do a lot of good stuff. We're just gonna give Licorice their things, which, how close are they to getting, uh, their affection? Only, like, Plumbing 12 more. Alright, by the way, if you're wondering where a bunch of my crystals went, that's gonna be for a future episode that's gonna come, uh, in a couple days. It depends on how many new things there are. Let me just check. By the way, I went to this, uh, only once. I only... Basically, I would skipped the intro, however, I did go into this a couple times because when it updated, my game was still muted, so I had to turn that on. But there's a couple things, like there's this cookies and pet package, where it gives you all this stuff for 10 bucks, which... It's actually a pretty solid amount of stuff, which uh, I like the little uh, number, or no, not number, letter cubed up there. Uh, also, is there any new events? There happens to be a lot of new events. Uh, there's Cookie of the Year, I gotta record that. Uh, the Shining Glitter Fan Club, Time, Time Weaver uh, Scissors? Huh. And there's also uh, the Clear the Puzzle, Meet the New Cookie. What? Complete all the puzzle missions for a special reward. What? Oh, wow. That's interesting, okay. And there's also this, Fashion Magazine Daily Reporter on the Scoop, 2021-10. Phil the- Phil Kogi- Kogu? With trendy keywords, okay. Wait, is that a magazine event? Was I right about that? No way! Oh my gosh, I gotta check that out later. Okay, okay, okay. Let's- let's focus on the main thing. We have to get the new cookie and the new pet. As you can see, uh, it says the new pet is right there and the new cookie is right there. I'm gonna spend some crystals, I use my key in another video. But let's do that. We're, ba we're basically having triple chances of getting this. So let's hope that we're going to get lucky enough for it. Alright, special cookie chest. That's zombie. That is cheesecake. I'd like more cheesecake though. Rockstar. Here it comes. That's popping candy. Maybe this will be it. There we go. Chocolate bonbon cookie. We got her. Picks and chooses clothes that match the, ima the imagined fashion tire. Is her, is her skill going to be similar to... Uh, Sour Boat Cookie? Probably not, but probably in a similar sense. By the way, they did, like, cookie, the official Cookie Run YouTube channel did, like, show a video about one day before Chocolate Bon Bon would be officially released, where it just showcased her skill, uh, Magic Candy and all that stuff, her pet and all that. But I didn't watch it because I wanted to be blind to it. I wanted to experience it all for myself. That's why I usually do for these updates. Uh, but fashion is in the details, of course. And we also gotta get her pet now, being, uh, did they have a name? I... Well, you know what? We'll figure it out once we actually get it. Okay, so. There's five in here. Mini Jackson number two. What, whatever happened to Mini Jackson number one? Now I wonder that. Uh, Dumbo Twins. The Cloud Pelican. Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. That's a producer mic. That's for Plumbing Shining Glitter's pet. And that's for Sour Belt's pet. I guess we'll open another one, because why not? Come on. Princess Locket. Energy Scale. And Lemon Slice. Now our epics. Is the angel light stick. <laughs> Please? That's the Lotus Polywag. Those are three times the chances, and we didn't get any of them yet. Come on, Glitter Ball. Rocket Firecracker. Dragon's Earth. So far, every single pet has been different. Producer Mike, and that's our first repeat. And there we go. The Bon Bon Birdie. I like that name. It's cute. Flies to an obstacle, uh, pecking it, and creating Chaka Bon Bon Jellies. Interesting. And of course, I'm pretty sure for the treasure. Uh, it still has the spotlight as like the main focus. But yeah, I guess we'll just move on to the trial now, now that we got both the pet and the cookie. And since there's no new treasure, we'll just immediately move on to the trial. Let's go over to trials. It says new trial. And look at that chocolate bonbon cookie trial. All right. So before we do any run, Oh, I like how it automatically equips us with the scissors. I'm probably just going to keep those equipped because there was an event where we have to get some points with the Time Weaver scissors. So, may as well just keep those equipped. But also, I think for this, this I'm probably going to equip my big treasure thing. And also, instead of the Lucky Clover things, I think I'll put this on. Seems nice. And also, I got to upgrade you, first of all. So, let's get you to level 4. Beautiful. And they do have another costume, but so far I can only get it if I get the... Uh, you know, the actual costume from the ACID thing, which I'm gonna try and do that in the future, though I do gotta, like, grind up more for it. Like, I actually gotta try and get the costume first of all, which takes a li little bit of luck. But, okay. There we go. Both at level 4. Now I'm gonna read off their skill and their story. So, 
Here's Chocobonbon's story. According to the Everything Fashion section of the fashion magazine, Kogu, or Ka Kog? Kogu? I'm gonna pronounce it Kogu just in case. Chocolate was the first brand ever to open a boutique for custom-made cookie suits. This brand has its roots going back as far as ancient kingdoms. During that time, countless designers have come and gone, but the only one who has been called the cookie fi fi Fication. The cookification of the brand is Chocolate Bon Bon Cookie. This cookie's intricate designs are only possible with a perfectly even layer of chocolate. Praised for the hand-embroidered flower patterns created with gold-coated thread, Chocolate Bon Bon Cookie even has works on display in the clothing museum. Even at the top of the fashion world, this cookie still personally takes the measurements of the clients to make sure the quality of her work is kept at an exceptional level, but no matter how much trends change, classic is forever. And of course, their skill is they pick and choose clothes that match the imagined fashion attire. Is this gonna be like level three of the, uh, eight, like the plumbing? Well, it's like fa uh, Super Fashion Week, where you gotta remember the clothing and you gotta pick them. That'd be. That's so cool. Okay, the cookie starts working on the next fashionable attire at certain intervals. An imagined design will appear above the cookie's head, and a mannequin will appear on the right. Choose the correct. A design for the following hat upper body and lower body apparel you can change your selection from each item of clothing with the arrow buttons the finalized the tire will be compared with the originally imagined design and designed points will be yielded accordingly a perfectly matching design will grant bonus points level up for more design points that's so cool but now we're going to meet up with the pet being the bon bon birdie and the pet says for the story, as Chocolate Bon Bon Cookie's trusty helper, Bon Bon Birdie takes care of everything to the very sewing of the outfits for the fashion weeks, or the fashion shows. Rumor has it, the sharp needle beak has never once missed the mark. That combined with speed surpassing even the most experienced designer cookies, it's no wonder Chocolate Bon Bon Cookie keeps entrusting this companion to work, or just would work. And their ability is that they fly, they fly into an obstacle, pecking it and creating Chocolate Bon Bon jellies. Destroys obstacle at certain intervals by pecking at them with its needle beak. While pecking, Chocolate Bon Bon jellies are created. After a certain amount of pecks, the obstacle is destroyed and level up for more points for the Chocolate Bon Bon jellies. Alright, so what do people recommend for this? Treasure, the Time Weaver Scissors, and the Hot Rod. Okay, well I guess I can swap this out because I'm pretty sure I have the Hot Rod at a high enough level. Yes. Now, my Time Weaver Scissors aren't at a high enough level, but if it only requires level 8 for Chocolate Bon Bon, and all I need to do is get their Magic Candy up to level 5, and if I can get their Super Epic, I'm pretty sure I can actually make it to Diamond Rank just in a future episode. But for now, we have all the settled, so we may as well get started on the run, and we're gonna, two, we're gonna do two runs. One without the Magic Candy, and one with the Magic Candy. Oh, by the way, if anyone wanted to know, there's this whole set where if you want to spend $10, you have the potential to get this pet if you get them all the way up to level 15, of course. But there's also a package that you can buy for them. Like, here's level 1, or volume 1, and then here's volume 2 to fit your fancy, and here's volume 3 if you have $30 to spare. So, anyway, with that all out of the way, let's do this. Perfect measurements are a basic staple design of fashion. What was it? Uh, what do I do? Uh, this one? Okay, there's that. Alright, uh, this? Okay, okay, I get it. Alright, these? Yeah, they look fine, I think. Are they perfect? I think it's per Oh, that's so cool! I love that! Alright, let's perfectly jump over these. Oh, those are little coat hangers! Oh, I think I was right. In that one episode of Super Fashion Week, I was like, I saw this level design background, and I was like, is this like a teaser for, uh, Chocolate Bonbon? And, yes it is! But, okay, I really like this music in the- <laughs> He's pecking at it! Peck at the clothing! Alright. We gotta hang off coat hangers. I know that's the theme for this level. Not only did I see coat hangers in jelly form, but... Oh, it's like a clothes rack. Oh, cool. But, okay, uh... I gotta imagine. Uh, this looks like a marshmallow. I uh, got that. Alright, what's the, uh, the... Chocolate wig, I think. Okay, it's Sparkos, then it'll initiate to you that... Okay, this is the correct one. Oh, that looks beautiful! Look at that. Mmm. Such a thing of beauty. Oh, okay, that was scary. Okay, hop on that. Get the speed. Hump, Molly. Okay, good. Let's move on with these simple jumps. And someone's running away with the loot? You're dropping your clothes! Or did you steal them? You thief. I, <laughs> I'm getting the refund, whether you like it or not. You thievian. I will get this. At least I'm getting more money with these treasure chests. Except those, this, that's a fireball and not money. Uh, okay, a uh, hat. This is a hat. That's <laughs> yep, that's a hat. Uh, uh, this thing. Good. I'm missing those rainbow bear jellies though. Uh, this one, this one. Oh, I almost messed up on that. 
If only I got those rainbow bear, 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 those rainbow bear jellies. I'm still in bronze three. It's kind of sad because I'm getting a lot of points now. Well, there we go. Well, I guess after all that, it shouldn't be too much harder. But look at all these people running. They're just appreciating all the cloves. Oh, they're coming out. Oh, and here comes you. No one? No one? Okay. Okay, double jump for that one. Double jump for this one. There's some that are going to be single, and some that are going to be double. I love the designs for these cookies. You know they went all out for this. Uh, you need a little top hat. You need a teeny tiny top hat. The energy still goes down while the skill is active. Okay, now we need that bottom. There we go. The energy still goes down while it's active, and apparently we're already glowing red, even though we seem to have still, like, a fair decent amount of energy left. Let's at least get to silver, too, because I feel- Oh, no, wait! Okay, good, we got the big potion. Okay, we can still do some progress here. I feel like maybe we can make it to silver one at the very minimum? I mean, I'll take whatever rank I can get, but I'm pretty sure once we get the magic candy, we're definitely gonna have a lot better of a chance to get, you know, a higher score. Uh... Choc oh, that said, uh, cocoa or chocolate? Chocolate? Yeah, maybe. Uh, let's get ourselves a hat. A very beautiful hat. Let's get ourselves a wonderful dress. And last but not least, we need to get ourselves a beautiful, uh, pair of bottom wear. I was, I was gonna say pair of leggings, but they don't look like they're gonna show off legs. But look at that. Now we're at silver one. So, can we have enough to reach gold three, maybe? That'd be cool if we could make it without even the need for magic candy. But if we don't, I at least can guarantee we should be able to make it without, uh, you know, getting hit. Because getting hit can really play a big factor in all of this. But if we can't make it to uh, gold 3, I can at least guarantee we can make it. Oh, no, wait. Okay. We made it without even needing a magic candy. And I... Uh, I feel like if I could have jumped, I could have gotten a couple more there. But you know what? That was a pretty good run. I like that. All right. So we also got some rewards here that we can pick up, too. Which, I don't want to watch your ad right now. I want to get a bunch of... You can get... Did I see rainbow cubes? Yes, there are. Look at all the stuff that we got. Oh, that's straight bank right there. I love that. Uh, I was about to say, did we also get a bonus mission? But they don't have bonus missions. That It makes me upset. Alright, it's time to set up their magic candy. Which, we don't have any of these things. But you know what? We may as well buy them with... Uh, how much magic power does they have? I got to take? 3,000? I guess I could buy them with crystals. But you know what? Eh, it's whatevs. Let's make this beautiful. I really wonder what this magic candy is going to look like. Maybe chocolate with like a beautiful outfit. <laughs> oh no, it has a swirl and like a little... Is that a cherry or like a uh, jelly on top? I don't know, but I really like that swirl. Sewing level one. Or sewing. Alright, let's buy f uh, five more of the... No, that's three more. Let's get that to level two and let's get, let's get this all the way up to level three. That didn't work. I said let's get this all the way up to level three. Please, load. Dang it. Is magic powder better suited for you, my dear? No, it's not. You just, you're just taking all the money out of me. No, I want to buy what's needed, please and thank you. I can't press the X. There we go. Thank you very much. Finally, level three. All right. So it's sewing level three, and the magic candy effect is a sewing counter accumulates after completing a design. Slide while the gauge is active to start sewing. With each stitch reducing the gauge, each time the gauge depletes to a certain point, the cookie finishes creating a fashion piece. The stronger the enchanted power, the more tailoring points earned. Okay, so I guess while sliding, we can give ourselves like the capabilities of sewing something, and then we can get extra points out of that. Okay, I guess I'll just have to test that out while you know we start running. So. Let's give this a gander. Some of our clientele refused to buy anything other than this brand. Is that what they said? All right, let's go. Let's give ourselves a marshmallow hat. Give ourselves a big bushy chocolate pudding-like outfit, and also that beautiful marshmallow dress. I would, I would kill to actually wear some of these outfits. But oh wait, oh wait, how how, how do I do this? Uh, I need to like slide at like. Okay, there's three. Am I doing it well? I don't know. Uh. Slide, slide, okay. Okay, at least I think I got extra points for that, so that's good. Sliding at these correct intervals. Intervals. You say interval or interval? I don't know, but whatever the case, I need to get these designs done. I need to get this video done. Okay. Okay, select these. Do they, do they only appear after I uh, do the ability? Because I feel like that might be the case. I think. Let's get some good pants on us. And look at that. That looks beautiful. It looks beautiful. Okay, I think that is the case. Because after that ability just finished, 
uh, then it, I basically got the five things to uh, make the thing. <laughs> I got the five little activation things so I could do my ability. That's what I'm trying to say. And also they magnetized toward me, even though I had to mess that up. I could have aimed at it, I could have tried to get it, but that would have risked me getting hit, and that that honestly wouldn't be- I, I would not have cared. And by that, I mean I would not have cared for the Rainbow Bear Jelly, I would have cared getting hit. What I meant to say was, I'd rather get hit- and, Oh my gosh, am I suck at- I suck at speaking. Uh, what I meant to say was, I'd rather miss the Rainbow Bear Jelly than get hit. This one. Oh my gosh, I'm getting so confused on my words that I feel like I'm messing up everything. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Entities and Guardians. Get that. Uh, that. There we go. Charge it up. Okay, yep. Nope. Got that. Okay, whole ability has been accounted for. Hopefully I can get this, uh, magic candy all the way filled up, and also I can get that super epic, and also get Chocolate Bonbon a couple more levels just so I can get that diamond rank. Because it's proven, I really don't need to do all that much except just to boost uh, Chocolate Bonbon bon because I already have the pet at level 4 and all that was required for it was level 3. And also, I do need to upgrade the uh, time scissors too. So, I'll probably- oh, get that. I'll probably need to go to the gacha and just like spend some uh, crystals to uh, try and uh, get myself that special pair of scissors. I hope I can at least. Okay, I know there's a light potion over here so I will pick that up. Pick all these up. Nice. Pack at him. Peck at all these outfits. Remember, peek. Not, no, no, peck, not peek. Well, I guess you can peek at the outfits, but you better have the money to spend. Because these things aren't... They, they aren't coming cheap. Chalk a lot. I chalk a lot. <laughs> I, that was meant to sound like I talk a lot, but... Eh, whatever. I hope people still understood the joke. Uh, get that, there we go, get the outfit, and now we need to get the beautiful dress. There it is, and we should be fine. I wonder how many total combinations of outfits could be made with this. Because it's got to be a decent amount. By the way, I think we left gold 3. So we have... No, 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 we're gonna leave gold 3 in a minute. Now, Yeah, now we're at gold 2. I don't think... We'll, are we gonna have enough for gold 1? Oh, maybe I should actually remember to use my ability. And maybe that could help. Uh, might be close. I don't know, though. Uh. Oh, oh my gosh! I can't believe I did that! I can't believe I did that! Is that oh my gosh, that was such skill! Oh, that was so cool! Alright, uh, dress, dress. Let's get that dress. Oh, that was beaut- that was like a clutch moment getting to gold one. I even made it to Emerald 3! That's- that was a clutch of the if- if you're at level 4, Chocolate Bonbon, and you're able to pull that off, that's amazing. Emerald 3 made it all the way up to Emerald, I am very happy about that. And also get some extra rewards. Mmm, look at that. Even I got one of these, which is gonna help me with those time weavering scissors. But, okay. With all that being said, I think I can finish this episode happily off now. So, I think the cookie is really nice, very elegant, very cool, definitely like the mirror to uh, Sour Belt Cookie, and I would, I would definitely recommend getting this cookie and giving him a run, because it is pretty beautiful, to be honest, but with that being said, if you did enjoy this video, then please be sure to leave a like on it, and share, share with your friends more cookie run content, and if you enjoy my content in general, why not subscribe to my YouTube channel, and if you haven't yet, or you want to, hit the bell icon next to the subscribe button to receive all my notifications on this YouTube channel in the near future, and last but certainly not least, I have merchandise in the description if you want to check it out, I'm not forcing you to buy anything, I'm just saying there might be something interesting in the shop that you might be interested in, but above all else, I will see you entities and guardians in the next video. Hail the Hypnese!